Now emboldened by his recent capture of the Katana fleet and staffing them with clone personnel, Grand Admiral Thorne launches his offensive against the New Republic with great victory. Though certain deception techniques such as faking a turbo laser barrage using cloaked ships to fire underneath planetary shields, several planets quickly fall to the Empire. He ups the ante when the Imperial fleet deploys 22 cloaked asteroids, or Coruscant, and fakes the presence of over 260 asteroids to immobilize the planet. Republic Leadership By this time, Mon Mothma finally reconciles with Senator Garm Bell Iblis, whom she leads Coruscant defenses. Elsewhere, Han Solo, Chewbacca, and Talon Card work together to form an alliance of smugglers to assist with the New Republic defenses. Although the smugglers consider staying in the sidelines, an Imperial raid on their meeting takes place. Finally, unites them against the Empire. Mara Jade, who was knocked out in the climax of the previous novel, joins Princess Leia and Han in stopping the Imperial Commando forces sent to Coruscant to kidnap Leia's newborn twins for Jedi Master Joris Kaboth. The Jedi Master wants to turn Leia, Luke and the twins to the dark side. The raid's sole survivor points to Mara Jade as their role model and she is arrested. But she comes clean to Leia about the Wayland cloning facility as they slip out of Coruscant Republic security shuts down. Mara, Luke, Han, Lando, Chewie, the droids, and the card travel to Wayland. They slip past Imperial forces in the area with help from the Nigori and two local aliens races. Han, Lando, and Chewie rig the base to explode. Mara and Luke, Card, and Leia face Joris Kaboth, who produced his own Skywalker clone named Luke, using Luke's hand that was lost at Bespin during the events of The Empire Strikes Back, intact with Anakin Skywalker's own lightsaber to attack them. After the fierce battle, Having learned Thorne's deception strategy, the Republic fleet organizes an assault on Imperial shipyards at Bill Bringy to capture a device that can find the cloaked asteroids over Coruscant that have been disguised as ghost asteroids. A faint operation at Tandrine will draw Imperial forces away from Bill Bringy. However, General Grand Admiral Thorne sees through the deception of marshals his forces at the strip shipyards. When the Republic fleet and the smugglers attack, the Imperial forces severely maul them. Things nearly go the Empire's way until Captain Gilad Palian receives a word of the attack. On Wayland. When he reads the Nagori were among the attackers, Thorne's own Nagori bodyguard, Ruch, stuns him and kills the Admiral himself before disappearing. With now all hopes of victory dashed by Thorne's death, Palian orders all Imperial assault. Back in Coruscant, Luke gives Mara Jade his father's lightsaber.
hope you've understood the book's storyline by Timothy Zahn as these original books of trilogy after Return of the Jedi. The books when if ever made into George Lucas's CGI movie franchise then it would be a must see. However due to JJ Abrams producing the storyline and the overall rating of Star Wars has fallen into your own version of imagination instead of the original books. If you're a Star Wars fan, you will appreciate the books more than the movies. Hope you've enjoyed the video and please click like and support by subscribing. Tata from Shabby.